And we have a green light on the field. Pilots prepare, drivers behind the line, and three, two, one, go! Two red robots on the move, five points each, 54-10, trying to deliver a spring. They've got it on the spring, but it fell off. Two blue robots on the move, flag up in the air. I'm not sure what the foul is. Score is 15-15. Twenty-seven, ninety-seven, trying to deliver a gear onto the lift. Up it goes. Pilot's got it in his hand. Another gear going up on the red airship. You'll notice each airship has a gear up on board at the beginning of the match. That is basically a free gear, but it cannot come into play until the tele-operated portion of the game starts. I mean, I'm not, I'm not 120 red, 55 blue. Each time a new rotor is spinning on board the airship, that is 40 points. If they happen to get it spinning in autonomous, that'll be a 60 point score. Forty eighty-seven, trying to slow down the progress of the Red Alliance, but also trying to get a gear of their own. Defense being played here underneath the Red Airship. Forty eighty-seven working their way down to their airship to deliver that gear. Their teammate 1912 is trying to deliver a gear as well. 120 red, 95 blue, 55 seconds remaining. Twenty-seven, ninety-seven. They've got a gear on board. I'm not sure that's the way they intended to load it. Remember, a robot can only carry one gear at a time. So if they've got a gear stuck in there in a weird way, that probably prevents them from getting another one. Thirty seconds remaining. Robots may start to climb on the airship in the last thirty seconds of the match. Ropes going down. Robots going up. 1487 is hooked and up, up they go. 13 seconds remaining, 120 to 120. 4087 is up and that light has got to be lit at the end of the match. Blue is lit, red is lit. Another blue robot going up, 1912 trying to get it. Three, two, they're up, one, that's the match. All right, final score is coming up. Blue gets the win, 195 to 170.